9 Kink Online. Your source for entertainment news, TikTok, Instagram news, and celebrity gossip. The hottest Instagram models' photos and videos. Check out our latest post. The former president of the United States has made public his phone number as he encourages his online followers to send him a text while also urging them to vote. Please 3 seconds to subscribe to our channel. Former US leader Barack Obama wants fans to text him after sharing his number on Instagram and Twitter. Taking to social media, the politician told followers he planned to try something new while encouraging them to send me a text on the number he provided. If you're in the United States, send me a text at 773-365-9687 I want to hear how you're doing, what's on your mind, and how you're planning on voting this year, he penned. I'll be in touch from time to time to share what's on my mind, too, Barack added, alongside a photo of himself and wife Michelle. The number he posted is part of a new platform called Community, which allows influential people to send or receive text messages without providing their personal contact details. According to their website, Community is a new conversation platform enabling direct and instant communication at massive scale, all through text messaging. The text message initiative is reportedly part of a campaign to register new voters, as Barack backs Democratic nominee Joe Biden to overtake Donald Trump as POTUS in November 20. Two weeks after the presidential election, Barack Obama is expected to release the first volume of his memoirs. Titled, A Promised Land, the book is scheduled to make its way out on 17 November 20. He said, there's no feeling like finishing a book, and I'm proud of this one. I've spent the last few years reflecting on my presidency, and in a promised land, I've tried to provide an honest accounting of my presidential campaign, and my time in office, the key events and people who shaped it, my take on what I got right and the mistakes I made, and the political, economic, and cultural forces that my team and I had to confront then, and that as a nation we are grappling with still. Thanks for watching, please subscribe for more upcoming videos.